Getting ready now for the entrance of Billy Jack Kane. As he challenges NWA World Heavyweight Champion Rick Flair. What you're hearing is the new theme song for Billy Jack Haynes. There's Billy Jack Haynes. And now, about to make his way through the crowd, the National Wrestling Alliance World Champion, Rick Flair. Jack Haynes. And this has got to be the biggest fight of his career. Oh, there's a lot of things happening for a lot of people tonight, in and outside the ring. You can hear, by the reaction of the crowd, the champion is approaching the ring. Rick Flair. And he does live up to his last name. The man does have style. He does have flair. Trying to work his way through the crowd. He's never seen anything like this in Portland before. Look at this. Look at the rope. Look at the flashy style of the world champion. Ladies and gentlemen, your last event of the evening will be one fall to a 45 minute time limit. This will be for the NWA World Heavyweight Championship. Introducing on my right, 240 pounds from North Carolina, the NWA World Heavyweight Champion, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Rick Flair. His opponent. And 55 pounds from Portland, Oregon, Billy Jack Payne. <laughs> Rick Flair, the familiar strut around the ring. These two men have met before in Portland at the sports arena. But this somehow seems a whole lot bigger. Maybe it's just because it is in the Coliseum. Maybe it is because there are 13,000 people. Oh, look at that, huh? That's a patented move by Ric Flair. Ric Flair has held this title longer than any man has held a world championship title. A little bit of trivia there. Billy Jack Haynes. If you've been watching Saturday Night uh, Wrestling from the Portland Sports Arena, you saw a special tape a short while ago. That, oh, look at that. He just shoves Ric Flair right across the ring. Look at the look. I look on Ric Flair's face. So, whoa, what happened there? You saw a tape of Billy Jack working out, getting ready, getting prepared for this match. This match means more to Billy than anything else he's had before. He is ready. We saw him before. We saw him tonight as we came into the arena. Oh, I just... Eye of the Tiger was all over the face of Billy Jack Haynes. Both men lock up again. 
both men very powerfully built. Oh, he diverted his attention from Flair, and Flair caught him in the chest. A reversal whip into the tur turnbuckle. Oh, look at that! Here comes the body slam, Billy Jack style. Yes, sir. Now that is Flair. <laughs> Flair got slammed. Billy Jack Hayes moving in as Rick Flair cowers in the corner over here. One right hand after another, landing on the side of the face of Rick Flair. There's another one. Here comes a hard smash into the chest. Another hard smash into the chest, delivered by Billy Jack Hayes. You can hear those. You can hear them all over the arena. Big elbow across the back. People around the ring are yelling, Full Nelson, Billy, Full Nelson. Now Flair moves Billy in. Uh -huh, another hard smash. That put Rick Flair down. Flair's eyes are very cautious now. They have a look of uh, cautiousness directed towards Billy Jack Haynes. Haynes blocked that when he came back with a hard smash of his own. And down goes Flair. Oh, that rang his bell. Billy going for the pin. One, two. And Flair kicks out in the nick of time. Flair leans against the rope. The crowd. Listen to the crowd. Billy can hear him. He can feel the crowd. Billy threatening to really lay one on him. Flair shaking his head. No, no, no. And now, gets Billy into the corner. Both men just huddling away on each other. Flair driving his shoulder into Billy Jack Haynes in the turnbuckle. Now, Billy just turns him around. Oh, Sandy Bar caught that. And Rick Flair caught Billy Jack Haynes. Oh, now Flair pushes Sandy Bar. Flair could get disqualified here by pushing a referee. Now, now Sandy Bar and Rick Flair may, may have a little extracurricular activity going here. We may have another bout going in the ring. And once again, people throw things into the ring. It's unfortunate. Now Flair grabs Billy, and outside he goes. Out into the concrete. Now, again, Rick Flair receiving a warning from referee Sandy Barr to back off. Let the man back in the ring. Billy Jack on his feet on the other side of the ring. Now, just trying to get back in the ring, being met by Flair. There's a hard shot. And Billy Jack drives his shoulder into Flair. And now coming across with a victory roll. Flair fighting it, trying to get to the ropes. And does he get to the ropes? No! Billy Jack Hayes is getting that victory roll. This could be... This could be it! He's got him one, two, and Flair kicks out. Oh, man, that was close. I thought that might have been it. Here comes an arm whip. A reversal whip into the turnbuckle. And now Billy gets Flair into the sleeper. The crowd wants him to change it into a full Nelson. I don't know if Billy's in position well enough for that. Flair trying to make it to the rope. Flair just trying to get over to the corner anyway. He's got the grasp of Billy. Billy's got that sleeper. Locked in on Ric Flair. Remember, this is for the belt. The NWA World Heavyweight Championship belt. Flair trying to reach the rope. Flair reaching for the rope. Sandy Barr pushing the ropes away. Flair can't make the rope. Billy Jack still got that sleeper locked in. Flair, the strength being sapped from his body. One, two, and oh, man, I thought that was it. I really thought that was it. Flair, Flair put his right foot over onto the bottom rope, and that's going to force a break. Sandy Barr counted two with bringing that hand down for the third count, and Flair put his right foot over that bottom rope. Here we go again. Another. Fully extended above his head, body slam. Yes, sir. Oh, Rick Flair rolled out of the way, and Billy elbowed the mat. Nothing there but mat. Oh, very tough mat. Billy staggering to his feet. Rick Flair trying to get behind Billy. Flair extremely exhausted. Both men very exhausted. Flair is going, oh, Paul Nelson! Flair was going for a suplex, and Billy got him in a full Nelson, and Flair made it to the rope. That's all Flair was thinking about. Rope, where are the ropes? 
Get me to the ropes in time. And they did. Billy, a hard smash across the chest of Ric Flair. Elbow coming down in the back. Here comes trying to get him in position for an el uh, arm whip on the ropes. And the clothesline coming off those ropes. Man, I'll tell you, Ric Flair's feeling that one back to North Carolina. Woo! Yes, sir, Billy about took his head off and put it in the tenth row over here. Billy Jack Haynes in a fight of his life. Ric Flair. Oh, just ran into a Billy Jack right hand. Hard smash across the chest. Oh. Three minutes. Ric Flair bleeding profusely in the forehead. Three minutes remaining. Three minutes. Billy trying to lock that abdominal stretch in. The abdominal stretch. That is a hole that is oftentimes a submission hole. Not this time with Ric Flair. Uh-uh. He powers out of it. Both men totally exhausted. Both men in a lot of pain. Both trying to get to their feet first. It looks like Billy's going to get to his. He falls against the rope. Flair very groggy. His eyes are glassy. And he just took up right hand from Billy Jack Haynes. Another right hand right to the forehead. Another one. Billy Jack Haynes just unloading. What do we say about Mount St. Helens? It just exploded on Rick Flair. Flair goes down in the middle of the ring. Billy Jack Haynes has got to start making his move with that full Nelson. A two count and oh, baby, that was almost two good again. Minutes, two We're minutes. down to two minutes left two in this minutes. championship match at the Coliseum. Our wrestling extravaganza. Arm whip into the ropes, coming off those ropes, and Flair misses with a haymaker, and Billy Jack Haynes. Ah, oh, Billy's leg is out over the bottom rope. So they've got to force a break there. The blood on Billy Jack Haynes, I think, is actually Ric Flair's. Billy just pounding away on the forehead of Flair. Working on that cut that's on Flair's forehead. Oh, both men, you can see how tired they are. Totally exhausted. Here comes an arm whip into the turnbuckle. Oh, another powerful body slam. There's the sign. There's the signal for the crowd. Billy Jack Haynes minute, is getting ready for minute, the full Nelson. Minute. Could we have a new heavyweight champion tonight in the Coliseum? Flying mayor by Ric Flair. Ric Flair stopping and roughing and stopping on the body of Billy Jack Haynes. Flair going to go upstairs. He's going to go up to the top rope. But I think he may have a little help down. Oh, yeah. He is. A little help from Billy Jack Haynes to come on down. There we go. Oh. And he just flew the very unfriendly sky. Rick Flair did. Billy Jack Haynes, this is it, ladies and gentlemen. Full Nelson. Flair fighting it. Flair fighting that full Nelson. Billy Jack Haynes has got it. Billy Jack Haynes has got the full Nelson on Rick Flair. He, I think he's got it locked in. The crowd is on their feet. We have run out of time. Once again, the bell saves Rick Flair. Billy Jack Haynes is waiting a little too long to get that full Nelson on Rick Flair. Had he tried just a minute or so earlier, we would have had a new NWA world champion. But Ric Flair will leave Portland, Oregon with the championship belt as time ran out on Billy Jack Haynes. We will be 45 back. 45-minute time limit. We'll be back part. with a special wrap-up right after this time. Winner.